Yo, what is going on guys, it's your boy Zeus here today and I'm back with a graphics settings video for Warzone. Um, this is kind of based on, well both to be honest, Caldera and uh, like Fortune's Keep or the other uh, Rebirth map. Um, first of all, what you're going to want to do is, is open up your NVIDIA control panel. Literally press your Windows button, type in here, NVIDIA control panel will come up. I've already got it open. First off, you want to go to display, which is up here. Go to change resolution. Make sure you got it on your recommended uh, resolution, which it, mine it is 1080. Um, your refresh rate definitely have that on your highest, which you have. Uh, 144 is my other one. 165 hertz is the one I'm running at the moment. Then you're going to want to go to da, 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 somewhere here, manage 3D settings, and literally copy every single setting I have on here. So if you need to pause it, definitely do that. I'm going to scroll down for you now. So once you've copied all of these settings, you're now free to open up Warzone. Now, on Warzone, you're going to want to go to your graphics settings. Uh, display mode, I would have this on full screen. I've got it on full screen boardless just so I can do this video rather than it like having to come out, go in, you know what I'm saying. So definitely have it on full screen, otherwise you're losing FPS. Also, your obviously your uh, graphics card. I'm using my 3060 Ti at the moment. I've got a different graphics card which I run, but I'm just running this one for tonight. Screen refresh rate is capped at 165 because of my monitor. Dynamic resolution, have this on disabled. This one, keep it on 60. Aspect ratio, automatic. And uh, this one is disabled. And your custom frame rate limit, have that on custom. When you go to advanced, copy these numbers in here. I'm not too savvy on this, but I've kind of just worked it all out adjusted the settings and honestly when you go into the game you'll just be like what is going on it's so clear so your brightness is obviously down to you i have it kind of really bright just so i can see uh your display gamma i have it on 2.2 and video highlights definitely disable this because this just is horrible for your fps if you have it on your reflex low latency have this on enabled and heading over to quality now field of view is obviously entirely up to you but i'd have it on 120 otherwise you're just missing out man like you can't see half of the stuff what you should see also with field of view you want to go to advanced and have the field of view ads on affected then your camera movement have this on least uh render resolution on 100 streaming quality on normal and this one on high this one, your Ansotropic, whether it is, have this on normal, otherwise it does something to your FPS and it, it really does not do it well. Uh, particle quality, have this on high. Uh, bullet impact and sprays, have this enabled, just because I like to just see what's actually going on in the actual game, to be honest. I don't want it to just be like a boring last game, just get FPS, if you know what I mean. Uh, tessellation, this one is a big hit for your FPS, definitely have this on disabled. Uh, this one, you can have either or, it's entirely up to you. This one's a biggie, you want this one on disabled, and it caps it on advanced anyway, you've got it disabled. Uh, this one on 1.00, your NVIDIA DLSS disabled, uh, anti-alazing, whatever it's called, I'm probably saying it's all wrong, but have this on off. Depth of field on disabled, and the other two on disabled. This is a lot to go through, man. <laughs> um, your shadow and light in, put this on low, enabled enabled and then particle lighting on low and the rest of them is disabled and i'm telling you guys this is the best settings you could possibly have when you get into the game you're going to be like damn man this is hella smooth like, even in the pre-game lobby it just looks so crisp um, if it's worked for you guys please drop a like and subscribe to the channel and stick around for NW2 because I'm going to have some settings video for you guys on there because I know how hard it is on PC when you're new to it and you're trying to get the best like graphics and all this stuff. It's a nightmare. So subscribe and it's been your boy Zeus and I'll see you next video. Peace.